sign up the uh, brief in condemning the Houthis attack on UAE and Saudi Arabia. Um, and you said that putting them back on the terror list is under review. Can you just explain to us what does under review mean? It's just like you want to see them more engaged in the terrorist attack? Is it a legal issue? Um, what does it mean? And some reports indicating that both the Pentagon and the CIA are actually um, agreeing that they should be put back on the terror list because they threat international water, world economy, etc. So what does under review mean? Under review just means that it's something that we are taking a close look at internally uh, within the U.S. government. Uh, to determine what would best uh, serve our national security interests, what would best serve our desire uh, to uh, be a partner to uh, Saudi Arabia, to the UAE, uh, to other countries uh, that are threatened uh, by uh, these Houthi attacks, um, what would also uh, allow us to best serve our interest in bringing an end uh, to this civil war in Yemen? that has not only wrought horrific violence and instability across the country, but has led to uh, a humanitarian catastrophe. If I recall, there are more than 16 million Yemenis uh, who are uh, suffering from food insecurity. Uh, and so we're taking uh, all of this and more into account uh, as we determine uh, the next best steps. Um, we will continue to work with our allies and partners in the region, uh, especially, uh, to promote accountability for the Houthis, for those Houthi leaders uh, that have been behind these terrorist attacks. Uh, we have uh, done this uh, in recent weeks, in recent months, using a variety of tools, uh, including uh, sanctions. I uh, would venture to guess you will see uh, additional uh, steps on our part to hold to account uh, those Houthi leaders who are responsible for uh, these reprehensible attacks. As I said yesterday, uh, we're not going to relent in designating uh, Houthi leaders and entities involved in military offensives that threaten civilians, uh, that uh, threaten regional stability, uh, that perpetuate the, con the conflict, uh, those who are responsible for some of the human rights abuses or the violations of international humanitarian law, uh, or that exacerbate the humanitarian crisis. When you talk about the humanitarian crisis, uh, there is one actor that is primarily responsible for the suffering uh, of the Yemeni people, the widespread suffering of the Yemeni people, uh, and that is that is the Houthis. Uh, so we are using uh, every appropriate tool, and we will continue to use every appropriate tool uh, to hold the Houthis uh, to account. Okay, I have two more questions on Iran. Um, 